Whose baby what sister weighed 155 ounces at birth? How many pounds and ounces did Zuni's sister weigh? If you'll notice when you read that, it already tells you how to deal with your leftover amount. And there's only two operations that we really ever use to have leftover amounts. Um, when we are talking about subtraction, sometimes the question may say, how many is left? And you know to subtract. The other time that you would have a leftover amount is what? When you're dividing. dividing. The problem is converting from 155 ounces to some amount of pounds. And they've already said express your ounce answer as pounds and ounces. So they've already kind of given us a hint that there's going to be a leftover amount. We're working with 155 ounces is a smaller unit of measure. Pounds is a bigger unit of measure. So this is a smile big daddy problem. So small big daddy means divide. divide. And your conversion number with pounds ounces is what? 16. Yes. You're going to be dividing by 16. So I'm going to rewrite that as a long division problem. 16 will not go into 1. It's a pretty big deal not to write anything over your 1. 16 will not go into 15. You also shouldn't write above there. If you start writing above a number that you shouldn't write above, it could cause a place value mistake later. So, um, since we barely missed going into 15, and this is a pretty big number, we're going to try 9, and we're going to multiply it out and see what we have left over. 9 times 6 is 54. Put down your 4, carry your 5. 9 times 1 is 9. Plus the five you carried is 14. So we have um, five take away four is one. Five take away four again is one. one. So you have nine with a remainder of 11. But we've already kind of talked about this. Like if you were going to Lowe's and you was going to um, get some lumber to build a porch, you wouldn't tell the guy that you needed um, 60 remainder two feet of, of wood. Nor would you do that with fabric or ribbon. You also don't, you've never probably heard anybody say, yeah, the baby was born yesterday. Oh, what's its name? And nobody ever says, well, how much does it weigh? And the weight is never nine remainder 11. So they've already kind of told us this would be nine pounds since it takes 16 ounces to make a whole pound. Do you have enough to make another pound? The leftover 11 here stands for 11 ounces that weren't big enough to make one more pound. Does that make sense? So your leftover amount is being expressed as ounces. We do not say that the baby weighed. We do not say Zuni's sister is nine remainder 11. That does not make sense. Okay, tonight's homework, you will be converting. It is gonna be from um, ounces to pounds. You are gonna have a leftover amount. Since it's ounces to pounds, what's your conversion number gonna be? 16. Yes. Thank you.